Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Mary with Finance Jar, and today we're discussing Experian Boost and how it can improve your credit score. If you've been looking into your credit score recently, you may have seen ads for Experian Boost. It's a free service offered by Experian, one of three major credit reporting agencies. Experian Boost makes a big promise that it can easily improve your credit score, but does it actually work? Today, we'll go over what Experian Boost is, who Experian Boost is for, how it works, its pros and cons, and finally, whether or not you should use it. Let's get started. So what is Experian Boost? Simply speaking, it's a service that lets you report bills like Netflix, phone, and utility bills like electricity or gas to Experian. This makes it easier for you to thicken your credit file and show a positive payment history. This in turn will boost your credit as long as you've been paying your bills on time. In theory, this is a huge boon for two groups of people. The first group is those of you who don't have credit cards or loans, or very few of them. If you haven't applied for credit or loans before, or very few, you have what's called a thin credit file. Basically, your credit report doesn't exist or has very short or limited payment history. Having a thin credit file can make it hard for new credit cards or loans because lenders really like to see a long history of credit use so they can judge how responsible you are with money. Rude! The second group is those of you who do have credit cards or loans, but haven't been good about paying them on time or at all. Hey, we're not judging. In 2022, things are more expensive than ever. Nearly 43 million Americans have student loan debt, and we all know the problem with medical debt. And who hasn't put a big ticket item on a credit card before and forgot to pay it off? Live a little. Anyway, if all those debts piled up and you didn't pay them back, they litter your credit report and damage your credit score. But if you've been good about paying Netflix, your utilities, and your cell phone bill, Experian Boost can put those into your credit report and help you gain some points back. Okay, let's get a bit deeper into how Experian really works. Typically, when you pay your bills each month or your Netflix subscription is deducted from your bank account, those on-time payments never appear on your credit report. With Experian Boost, you can add any of the following bills on your report to boost your credit score. For example, phone, internet, cable, satellite, gas, electric, water, and streaming services like Netflix, Hulu, HBO, Amazon Prime, and Disney+. Plus. Since you're already paying for these utilities and streaming services, you may as well earn credit for doing so. Experian Boost helps you do that. To use Experian Boost, you need to first sign up for a free membership on their website, Experian.com. Then you'll need to connect it to your bank account. During the sign-up process, Experian will ask which payments you want to add to your credit report. You can add payments from the past two years, but you need to have made at least three payments over a six-month period for an account to be added to your credit report. I know what you're thinking. You've spaced on a couple of bills and paid them late, so you think you're doomed. Don't worry, Experian will only add on-time payments to your credit report and will ignore late payments. If you change your mind or close an account, you can remove any accounts from your credit report at any time. Now, as with anything, there are advantages and disadvantages to using Experian Boost. Let's start with the good. Number one, Experian Boost is completely free. You can sign up and begin reporting your on-time bill payments at no cost, unlike other companies that offer the same services. Number two, Experian Boost instantly updates your credit report. Once you've added your account to Experian Boost, you'll see an immediate increase in your credit score. This can help you qualify for new credit cards or loans with better terms right after you register your Experian Boost membership. Number three, no risk. There are no credit checks involved and signing up for Experian Boost won't cause your credit score to drop. Even if you've missed a few bills or made late payments, that's because Experian only reports on-time payments. With that said, Experian Boost does have several drawbacks. Number one, it's less effective if you already have good credit. On average, Experian Boost users see around a 12 to 13 point increase on their FICO score. This can be enough to knock you into the fair or average credit score range, say in the 590 to 620 area, but it's not very noticeable for the folks in the 700 to 800 range. So if you've already had a solid payment history and a good credit score, Experian Boost isn't gonna benefit you very much. Number two, it only affects your Experian credit score. So unfortunately, your Equifax or TransUnion credit scores won't see an increase when you sign up. And that last one is indeed a major drawback. If you apply for a credit card or a loan that doesn't partner with Experian, they won't see any of that new stuff in your credit report and you will still show a lower credit score. Whether or not you should use Experian Boost boils down to this. 
If you have a poor payment history or a thin credit file, we recommend you use it. If you already have a decent credit score, it's probably a waste of your time. To sum things up, the amount that Experian Boost will increase your score depends on your credit profile. You'll benefit more if you have an insufficient credit history or that thin file we talked about earlier. If you have a strong payment history and a relatively good score, you'll see less of an improvement. With that said, registering for Experian Boost is generally a good idea because there are no costs or risk involved. However, if you're looking into building credit, signing up for Experian Boost is just a start, not the only step you should take. To take the next step towards better finances, watch these videos.